All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duels. So today is Wednesday, and that means that we are playing with Mecha Phantom Beast. You guys voted Mecha Phantom Beast. Okay. Uh, I'll try. I'll try. I, I mean, we already know Mecha Phantom Beast are straight ass, and if you don't, if you think otherwise, then leave, because this deck is not the greatest. But we're going to try our best. We're going to try our best to uh, do some plays. And I actually combined it with another deck, so if I get a little bit flack on that, I apologize, but I thought that combining it with a, with another deck would uh, give the deck a little bit more strength. And the deck that we're actually combining with is Speedroid. So, uh, Hopefully we can do some synchro plays. Uh, Speed Royce, it's been a while. They got a couple new cards since I played with them. Daily Duels, I never got put back on, and I never got to try those cards. So it's kind of killing two birds with one stone. So hopefully uh, this will go okay, and we can actually do some powerful plays, you know? So uh, one of the best cards in here is Transmodify. So I can Transmodify my uh, my Lion to summon a Speed Royce monster. So that's actually pretty cool. So then I can just, you know, special summon Terra Top, Terra Top do his thing, because they already know that the Speed Royce, uh a very powerful, very powerful. They're played by one of my favorite characters in the anime, uh, that being Yugo, and I just wanted a chance to kind of play him again, you know? So, uh, if you guys want to help me out with the Mecha Phantom Beast, I'd be very appreciative. I, you know, I'd definitely take the help. You know what? No, I have to say, I already know what's happening. I know what's So, you have a graveyard effect, right? This card is okay, I have this. You can summon the token. I believe it's like, you can, like, banish or something like that. This card, blah, 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 so it's a graveyard. Oh, I can get an additional normal summon. So if this card is in your graveyard, I can get an additional normal summon. That's pretty good. That's pretty cool, actually. That's pretty cool. Um, so I'm probably just going to go into my boss monster, which is probably one of my boss monsters, which is Clearing. You know? so I can go ahead and just tribute you off, summon uh, probably my Triad dice, my Red Eye dice. You know? And then another cool thing is that I is that Transmodify can actually, I can turn these into the Mecha Phantom Beast. So, like I said, there's plenty of plays. I think there's a lot of synergy with the deck. So, I'm just kind of wondering what I want to do. I think I want to maybe just summon him. I don't think I need to go on a Triad. Maybe go on a Stardust Charge Warrior with the the token. Like, we, we, we have some interesting plays. I'm, I'm Right now, I'm not definite on what I want to do with the deck. So, I'm just kind of fucking around. But you know what? I mean, fucking around, as long as there's still results, you know, it'll still be fine. So we can get rid of you, let me stick with something you, draw a card, so that's pretty good. Now I can transmodify my transmodify you into uh, another Mecha Phantom Beast, and then uh yeah, we still have place. We still have place. Oh, and then and then this, I can immediately normal summon an additional Mecha Phantom Beast. So actually, you know what? The synergy is that it's showing a little bit because I can summon you with you. And then synchro summon the crystal meth. And we already know that crystal meth is a boss ass bitch, so. There we go. We fucked around with it a little bit. We they weren't the best of plays, but they weren't the worst of plays either. And in the end, we actually did something. So I have Mega Raptor. There's the Mecha Phantom. I'm trying to think of all the Mecha Phantom Beasts. There's one, my other one, Mecha Raptor, and I, I don't know. We're not running too many. I think we're just running just the usual Mecha Phantom Beast, uh, a lion, this Mega Raptor, and then the other one. So I could transmodify into another Mecha Phantom Beast, but the question is, do I want to do that? You know. And then I'm running Chase Wings because Chase Wings is just really good. I, I, in my personal opinion, it's one of the best synchro car cards that synchros have been given in a cool minute. Like this, this card by itself can win duels. So I'm hoping that I don't get wrecked by a Twin Twister. So I'm just going to set the Tries Modify as Bluff. You know? And hopefully I'll be okay, you know? And how do you use your Crystal Mask to get fucked up, Regaki? Chase Wings. I can't be destroyed by my card effect, you know? So, you know, get wrecked. <laughs> exactly, right now. Chase Wings. So, no. <laughs> I mean, you're still going to resolve your uh, uninterrupted slumber, you know, doing all that. Yep. Or Chasing Wings, Following, Follow Wings, whatever they changed the name to in the TCG. So you still resolve your uninterrupted slumber, so you get a kaiju, I get a kaiju. You did it backwards, it's it's uh, it's you then me, yeah, so you're just going to scoop. Yeah, you messed that up. <laughs> and uh, we'll go ahead and get another duel. Be right back. All right, we're back. So uh, what's what are we going to talk about today? Well, I, I, there's two things. There's two things. So it might be like a double title in parentheses because there's two things. One, I want to give you guys that Morphoration Part Two because I never finished that off, you know. Uh, so we can go ahead and do that. I guess. I guess. I, want, I think this deck likes to go first. I think. I think I want to see. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'm insane. Uh, so I, I guess I could just take it slow, you know. Uh, I could summon you. I could summon you. And then Taka Tombor is just great in here because I'll control a wind monster. I could just such a summon. So that means I could special summon my 
my level one tuner, my try, I die, they can make you go inside a sink. I don't think I have any sink eights. Because it would be this. No, because this would go up by the. It's all because I control the token. I have to control Mecha Fenby token, which means that would be level seven. Let's put some Taka Tornborg. Trying to think if there's any like synchro monsters I could do if I summon like him or something like that. I guess I can go and just start a charge a charge warrior and draw a card. Like I said, that's that's never too terrible. And then he would be in the graveyard technically for uh, additional plays later. Because summoning this, there's just real point, you know. Uh, there's no other speedrun monsters you control. Yeah, except for himself. So there's no point in doing that. So I could just summon Duke. Then Duke could take our summon into Starter's Charge, and I get to draw a card. And drawing a card, still nothing to scoff at. And I would take, generally take the neg, but I get to draw, get a plus off of that. Alright, and I drew into a lion. Alright. I guess I'll just set the warning. The, the, the thing is, that I got to draw a card and I get a 20, uh, 2000 meter tackle special, which is not terrible. But the problem with that is that I lost my token, so my Tether Wolf, you know, ain't gonna be probably doing too much. And Photon Thrasher, so we're going against ABCs, we're going against that top tier shit, because that's the only deck I see Photon Thrasher in anymore, it's just ABC, so. <laughs> but, uh, so, yep, 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 how'd I know that? How'd I know that? <laughs> so, what's this card? This card's okay, where you can add one using your mouse from your deck to your hand. Okay. I just sent to, this card sent to Graveyard, period. Wow. So, there's your normal summon. So, more activation. Part two, plus what we're going to talk about, which is special ed. I, I'm not dissing anybody with special ed. I'm not special ed. Well, maybe when it came to making this deck, because I had no fucking idea what the fuck I was doing with this deck. Like, not even, you know, not even. Go ahead and go and you tell the lightning, because I know you are, obviously. But you with the solemn morning, so you can get the fuck out. Like, definitely no. The sad thing is, you still get that search because this said this card is sent. Oh no, it says from Fields and Graveyard. You don't get shit, my boy. <laughs> It's Wednesday, my dudes. Ha! No. <laughs> so, what can I do now? Like, really, I can just summon a lion, and then the lion can go into crystal meth. Like, that might be, like, one of the best things. And then I'll get a token. I can get the additional normal summon of the Mega Raptor, and, you know, all that jazz. And this trap will set my ass down. Alright, alright. Well, I guess I am pretty much done for my turn. Like... Endless Trap Hole just sat my ass down. I was about to go into Crystal Math. He probably should have waited for my Crystal Math. Like, you would have took less damage, but I guess you really wanted to hit me with that Endless Trap Hole. Like, alright. I mean, if this card is sent to I get a token regardless. So if you kill it, I get something. So you're still playing that top tier shit, so I can easily get fucked up. And I said, that Photon Thrasher, let's go, you know? More XC plays? Problem is that this card is sent from the field third graders, so you don't get anything, but it's one of the weaker. You know. And this card can't attack if you control another monster, so and so you're gonna attack me with your crush lion? That's fine, I get a token. <laughs> so a line, go ahead and give me that token. So now this can't be destroyed battle by card effect, which is nice. Might be able to might go into Draco Sack next turn or something along those lines. Wrath, yep. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna normal summon and go into Draco Sack. There's really no point in doing anything else. You gonna hit me with a bottomless or something along those lines with this? I mean, actually, you can. Well, you can hit me with another endless, but you can't bottomless me. Because I can't be destroyed by card effects. Yep, endless. Sit my ass down again. God, that's annoying. Then you're gonna throw a max C on me as if I'm gonna actually do something else. Like, nah. <laughs> I mean, this card can go up by 800 attack, but that would only get increase me to 25, which is not strong enough to get around that booty, so... Nah, I'll just allow you to take the neg on the max scene in my turn. <laughs> like, I don't even know what the fuck that was. So, more observation part two. So, the first time, observation, I didn't know that it was an assembly day, so usually I would observe for an hour and a half. It was only like an hour, per class, it was only like an hour and ten minutes, so, you know, rip on that. Um... I'm trying to think if there's anything I can really go into. Like, now that's two or more. That's two or more. Like, like he's kind of clogging my field with shit that I can't do. You have to be a mecha fan of beast tuner, so can't even go into you. Like, nothing I can really do with Duke right now. You know, 
There's nothing I can really do with Duke right now. I can summon Yo-Yo, but Yo-Yo can't do anything because the field is full. I really can't do much of anything. No, I can tribute the token, then go up and attack. No, that's what I'm doing in battle. Uh, then I could summon double Yo-Yo and then do that place. You know what? I think I'm going to take the Neg on the Twin Twister right now. Just to clear up his back row because I have a feeling that he might do something. I wonder how many trap holes he runs. You know? I'm kind of wondering on that. Dimension Barrier. Okay, are you going to call Synchro Summon? I'm not, I don't plan on Synchro Summoning this turn. Xe. Oh, that kind of sucks. I kind of, kind of planned on Xe Summoning this turn. Ah. Uh, so I took an egg, but then you took an egg to stop me with Dimension Barrier. It's a very powerful card, but it just doesn't do anything right now, so... Fast would be wonderful right now if I could make it. So I think I'm, think I'm just probably just gonna go for fast. I can attack, then use my effect. Should be off a token, just free up space. I'm, I bounce off your booty, which is fine, but at least it frees up space. And you know what? If you have another fucking trap hole, then fuck it, do it. You know, this, this duel is getting a little bit ridiculous. Doesn't look like it. Now I can Synchro Summon to all of these wonderful monsters, so I'm thinking that Fast might be the best one, because if my opponent controls a monster from the extra deck, I could just, you know, stop it. So I think we'll just go Fast like a NASCAR. Does it matter which one I use? Right, let me see. Yeah, Fast. So you want to try to, like, fuck me up with Rafflesia? Fast! Phew! Negate. Ah, I'm done for now. Problem is, I still can't handle fucking Rafflesia's booty. Like... Uh, well, no, no, because I can drop her. Is it attack and defense? I believe it's attack and defense. Ah, oh, goddammit. Goddammit. See, the upstart, seeing that next card, that would have been his next draw. It's just attack. Yeah, it's just attack. Yep, yep, yep. See, he's seeing that next card. He's playing top tier shit and he's not doing much at, of anything. That's sad. That's sad. I'm playing with fucking, fucking shitty ass Me Mecha Phantom Beast. He's in fucking the next top tier shit. Mm hmm. No, that's fine. I said I can wait for you because you're, I'm, I'm a bigger threat. That's a bigger threat than your ABC. So you use your effect, and I'll just negate you. I'll hit you up, you know? But then if you attack me, then I can hit you up during the damage step because I drop your attack, right? But God, it's just hitting me with endless trap hole, bottomless trap hole. Like, Crusader is just putting that work this tool. But, uh, so... The observation, I needed six, uh, no, I need five hours call. I only got it done within an hour and 30 minutes. So I need to observe one more class. It took me a while to get to that next class. You know, I went on my trip and I got sick. So uh, despite me going like ahead of time and trying to get it done as soon as possible. So please tell me I can activate this during the damage step. Again, I guess I'll find out because he did an attack declaration. So let's see if I can activate it during the damage step. Nope, nope, nope. Apparently I can't. So rip on that. So I guess I'll put myself in the pendulum scale. There's really no point. <laughs> you know, I thought I could activate during the damage step because I dropped your attack at zero, but I guess not. <laughs> push time when your opponent controls a special summon from the extra deck until the end of turn, attack becomes zero. Also, attack them again. I really thought that I could go during the damage step, activate my effect because I didn't want him to kill me. I wanted him to do his shit first. That's fine. That's not really much of anything. Oh, well, that's exactly what I needed to draw, actually. The question is, is he gonna fuck my shit up? Is he gonna fuck my steez? If he fucks my steez with his fucking plays, then I'll be fucking SLL. Because this is about this is about to be a crystal myth, so. If you're smart, you did your effect on my yeah, yeah. Like whatever, because this is this is about to be a crystal myth. All right. Oh, that sucks. Oh, I'm facing top tier shit right now. Like, like what the fuck, you know? 
can't do anything. Like, wow, this guy is actually playing bad because he's really playing that top tier shit, ABC skill list. You, you know, he's gonna beat me and I'm not playing a great bat. Like, fucking ABC Buster Dragon, so annoying. Like, you know what, I'm just gonna go ahead and surrender. I'm gonna go ahead and surrender, get another duel, bear back. So, it took me a while. Like, I think I did my first observation on like the 2nd of September and I didn't finish until like the 24th. But I need to get that shit done. Uh, yeah, I think this deck likes to go first because it really doesn't matter too much of what I do. Wow, this hand is just ass. <laughs> like, I guess I can summon this and this can give me a token, but there's like no combos or synergy or anything. Like, speed recovery, double yo yo, and double twin twister. Like, alright. Like, twin twister's great, but when you draw multiple twin twisters, god, it doesn't suck. Yeah. If he's playing anything remotely fast or relevant, because the mecha, mecha families are kind of slow, I might get destroyed because all he has to do is just get rid of my token and, you know, fuck me up. Oh, he's playing the new gen shit, too. So, I guess this will be interesting to see what this deck can do. Because I won't forget to play on daily duels, I can tell you, I tell you that. So, you send. And this one, he's equipped against Pierce, but. Are you gonna do anything else? Like, do you have like an additional normal summon or something? Like, Tensu seems like it'd be really good in this deck to get the additional normal summon or Beast Warriors, or is there only five Beast Warriors in Tensu? I don't remember. I know Tanky can search any Beast Warrior, so I think Tensu is just the additional normal summon of any Beast Warrior. That'd be really nice, because if all you're gonna do is just summon him and do that, then that's kinda anticlimactic to say the least. Not that I'm gonna do too much. Oh yeah, you could just slap on top. Yep. You know, you only need one. I thought, I thought you needed two. Like, no, you just slap on top, just one. So I believe you can just keep on slapping it on top in this deck. So I, it took me all the way until the 24th, but I only need that one observation. So uh, snuck in, got that one observation in. Uh, I wanted to go on Wednesday because I thought she would have class on Friday, but it ended up being that she had class. She, I mean, she had test on Friday because she generally has to do tests on Friday, so the students have no homework. But no, she did. Uh, she did the test on on. Wednesday, so I was on Friday, on Friday, and I got my observation done. There was really not much to say, you know. I actually corrected it, which is actually kind of funny. She actually made a mistake and I corrected it because I was just sitting right there, and I was I was paying attention to her lesson, but also paying attention to her as a, you know observing her as a teacher, doing all that, you know, observation. I have observation art is blah. So that class is exactly one hour and thirty minutes. So the, on top of my three hour and thirty minutes, bam, you know, I got done with my uh, my observation time, my exact five hours. So that's great. That's great. Uh, I got done with my last course, my, uh, my reading course, which is the pain in the ass, the one that I need the observation on. God, this is so boring. I'm just sitting here watching him slowly do plays, like, and I opened up ass, so there's not really too much I'm going to do right now. You know? So you can detach him, but then reattach the zero attack one, then detach the zero attack one, and attach... No, summon from the deck. Oh yeah, cause rat. So you do that rat, you get to summon rat. Like, okay. okay you do that material being rat to summon a rat. Okay, and then you can slap on rat. Like, <laughs> like his bar is just filling up, but I'm not seeing any amazing plays here. All right. Turning attack material, when it's causing target one face of card and fill, destroy it, so it just slaps it on top. Okay, then run over my top token and pop me, right? So I just need a top deck like a terror top or something, because if I don't top deck like a terror top or anything, I'm not doing shit. Yep, then you detach and pop me, right? Wow, you're not gonna pop me. Okay. <laughs> Uh, so I think I just kind of want you to like catch this Twin Twister real quick. Uh, no, I'll push that. So, pop your back real quick. Pop, pop. Wow, bottomless and endless, and just goddamn, the trap holes are being played for real. And it will synchro summon into our Sarge Charge Warrior who can fuck up both of these fuckers, so that's pretty good. And Lion, I get a token, charge, I get a draw. So looks like graveyard effects go off before field effects, so he could fuck me up with like guy like, good. Uh, shit real quick. Oh, that's during either player's turn. Oh. Didn't know that was during either player's turn. Well, I should have known that it was probably during either player's turn. 
That kind of sucks. Oh, I mean, I get an additional normal summon. So that's nice. I could go into like, like Night Ninja Dory or something like that, because I can speed recovery. Like, I just don't have too much of anything, you know? No, because this will gain the levels of the token that I have in the field, so. Uh. Yeah, give me an additional normal summon. I can summon Mega Raptor, and then Mega Raptor, I can send a token to get a search of a Mecha Phantom Beast. Like, I just, I, I just didn't open up too hot. I think it might actually be best just to speed recovery and actually summon that double yo-yo so I can kill both of his shits. Like, uh, if I would've opened up just, you know, like, really great, I'd be able to handle this situation. But because I opened up just kind of, my plays are just kind of in themselves. Like, I, did, I got Mecha Fan Beast who didn't do too much. I got my, I didn't get any, like, speed right, so rip on that. I'll just kill you and kill you. Still have plays, though. Oh, right. You can just equip whenever you feel like. Wow. All right. Well, all right. I scoop. I scoop. I opened up like ass and I forgot that the fucking snake. I, I don't know this deck well enough. Like, wow. That's, that's straight up hand trapping itself. Just bam, equip during either player's turn. So you jump up by 12. Like, all right. Well, get our duel. Bear back. All right. God, I, I went in blind. Still, I'm not, still trying to figure out whether this deck has to go first or second, so I'd rather him win. Never mind, I, I still won. I think I'm think still first, because if I can bust out my synchro plays or do something along those lines, then it's pretty good. Uh, once again, just got a shit ton of fucking uh, Mecha Phantom Beast and not really anything else. You know, I could return and then do a synchro summon play. You know, I'm doing like a Stardust Charge Away or something along those lines. It wouldn't be terrible, or a Sync 7. You know, I can go into uh, Clear Wing. Clear Wing wouldn't be too terrible. Clear Wing or Starter Charge Warrior draw a card or... Uh, I'm thinking thinking Starter Charge Warrior, so I'm thinking about... Yeah. Oh, I can't return tokens. That's right. All right. Well, that's good to know that I can't return tokens, so... I'll just go into Starter Charge Warrior. Like, I keep on opening up with all these fucking Mecha Phantom Beasts, and they're just like kind of... I'm like, I want some Speedroid. I kind of want some, uh... Some, uh... Oh, that, I mean, actually, drawing the full is actually really great because I can send uh, a lion. A lion will, of course, give me a token. And then I can get the additional normal summon, which means I can additional normal summon another lion, which means that I can go into Crystal Map. So actually, it's not too terrible. I just keep on drawing all these mecha fucking Phantom Beasts. Like, alright. Crystal Map, yay! Oh, you only get the summon once per turn. The additional summon I can get, but not the. Not the, uh, not the additional token. I guess it's only once per turn. No, you can only use, you can only use this effect, the token once per turn. Oh no, oh no, we're playing against that top tier shit. As soon as I see Skyrise, I just die a little bit on the inside. Because Skyrise is so fucking good as a field spell. Like, you already know that you're about to get it when you see Skyrise. I busted, I summon Crystal Mass and I'm still fucking shitting my bitches. But I guess I should just wait until there's a threat, pretty much. <laughs> Yeah, wait, wait until there's a threat and when there's a threat, fuck it up. Oh no, because of the token he can go into a fuck oh. But to say he can he can get out oh, of fusion and go into vortex, but then if he goes into vortex then I could fuck him up, but then he could fuck me up, so I would end up dying. I would end up dying. Because he would go summon fusion, bounce me, I would go negate, and then he would go negate on me. Especially now since he has something in his extra deck too. Like Uh I'm playing Mecha Phantom Beast gets that top tier shit boys, like Mm-hmm. But the special, the special end. Uh, that's my next course. That's my next course that I'm currently in now. Uh, I was hoping that was going to be a little easier. It's like, it's like TED 420, I think. It's, it's really up there. You know, like, these are definitely university courses now. So, I'll have to do something that. i do something that. i do something that. Ew, of course. Of course, he's playing that frog shit. No, I said wait for a threat. Wait for a threat. Is that a threat? Kinda. But, yep, and go ahead and grab your Tempest. Like, yay, Magistrator's thrown in. So, literally just cr continue creating Pendulum Dot deck. Because nothing on the field is a threat. Nothing nothing on the field can threaten my, my Crystal Math. So, like, if he goes into like a rank 3 and I break so I can negate that, he can't, can't attack over me. I guess he's just gonna attack my token. Like, okay. 
If anything, I'd rather be safe than sorry, because I don't want to negate this and then have this, you know, fuck me up. So. Oh, I can get the additional normal summon. Uh, uh, when this card is normal summon, it's, so this, I can normal summon this, and this card is, uh, when token special summon, I get an additional token, so I can just normal summon uh, Mega Raptor, and then get the additional normal summon of Tether Wolf. Tether Wolf will summon me a token, and then my Regga Raptor will summon me a token, so double token power. No, don't fuck my own shit up. So, normal summon, effect, summon a token. Effect, summon a token. And I could go into Dora, but of course he has that Tempest, so rip on that. <laughs> so this is like if a face up monster you control will be destroyed by battle while you control another monster. You get to draw cards through the performer powers, right? I'll probably just end up negating that. I said I could go into Dora. So I think I'll just kill you, kill you, and then kill you. Oh, you're not really a threat. Kill you, and then I can go into Dora in main phase too. The, 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 the Dora, because you won't have a magic specter on the field. So yeah, kill you, negate, kill you, because you can only use the effect once per turn, and kill you, because you're not a threat, like, at all. <laughs> Wait, the additional attack up? Like, no. No, thank you. I don't want you to draw. No drawing. No drawing. Oh, I thought this was when the monster was summoned, period. No, that's monster effects. It's a it's a song strike. I forgot it was a song strike. I thought it was a monster was summoned. <sighs> God, I hate facing this top tier shit, man. God, I hate facing this top tier shit so much. I can't even crack his pendulum skills or anything. Like, I guess I could tribute off and get a token. And then I can go into Draco Sack. I can go into Big Eye. And I guess I guess Big Eye wouldn't be terrible. Uh, yeah, give me another one of you. Like fucking. Of course, I, I forgot it was. A, I thought it was like a on a Heron summon. I thought it was a summon. I forgot it was a fucking Song Strike. I'm going to fucking Big Eye and take his fucking shit. I mean, either way, I'm fucked. I mean, I'm, I'm fucked. I'm going against top tier shit right here, like ABC, fucking pen, anything pendulum based. I'm playing, I'm playing fucking mecha fan beast. Like, come on, you know, you know. But the special ed class, I was hoping it's gonna be a little bit. It's a little bit easier, less workload. Like instead of two assignments per week and two discussions, two discussions, one assignment per week. But you know, so that's a little bit easier. Like I'm fucked. I'm fucked either way. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. You, you got the, you, you got that top tier shit. That top tier shit. Shit, you know. <laughs> I'm fucked. I am. I am fucked. You know. Ugh, fucking. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. So, yeah. Yeah. You squat, huh? Squat, huh? Squat, huh? Huh? That's all you needed, huh? Squat, huh? I got squat. Fucking uh, odd ice fusion. Let me go into my fucking vortex dragon. I got squat. Like, shut the fuck up. Like, you're playing the pendulum mechanic. That in itself is just broken as shit. Like. Wait, like, you got squat. Mm-hmm. I got squat. Playing fucking Mecha Phantom Beast, like ABC, like oh my god. Mm -hmm. I forgot I could use the extra deck. Shut up. Just just shut up. Like oh, I'm so fucked. <laughs> you still got plays for days. Like you're playing the pendulum mechanic, dude. My nag like, No 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 you you are golden. Pendulum summon, pop your scales, go for game, like, <sighs> like, wow, and of course, in Mecha Phantom Beast, where I play the fucking ABCs and the fucking pendulum shit, right? Like, just kill me now. <laughs> mm -hmm. I don't even know how I'm gonna get out of this situation. I don't really think I can. Like, that's the sad thing. Squat, huh? Squat, huh? Squat, huh? Squat, huh? Yeah, yeah, shut up, shut up. Shut up with that top tier shit. Top tier shit. <laughs> no, no, don't forget about anything. All, uh, everything you have is broken. Your shit is broken, all right? Like, you know? Like, nah, nah, nah. Like, 
I scoop. I scoop, nigga. I scoop. Like, I fuck off? Like, you fuck off. Like, oh my god. Like, oh my god. Look at Santa Beast. Just like, uh, and then open up, like, asked both duels that I needed to actually open up the journey. I did plays, but, like, the ABCs and the fucking pendulum? Come on. Come on. Rape me in the ass with a spoon when this shit. <laughs> so, this course. I need to buy a $90 book, so fucking, it was like $90 new off of Amazon with the, with the two-day shipping with Prime, or I could buy it, like, used for, like, $100. Like, what? Like, just give me a fucking new book off of Prime. But that was the cheapest it was gonna fucking get, so rip on that. And the great thing is, is that the special ed, uh, course, uh, special education course is probably gonna deal with dealing with special, special, special education. They want me to observe a special education course. How the fuck am I supposed to do that? Huh? How the... How the fuck am I supposed to do that? But I, I got lucky that there happened to be some teachers at my school that, you know, allowed me to get in. There's no background check. There's no fucking interaction with, you know, my, my college and the fucking high school. How the fuck am I supposed to get into the observer uh, fucking special ed course? And the, special, the observation, it's like 20% of my fucking grade, all right? 20% of my fucking grade. So if I don't do it, I drop automatically down to a B minus. Like, it's just like, wow, fucking fuck me, you know? It's just retarded. I'm gonna have to, you know, you know, email my fucking, my, uh, my professor and be like, how, how, you know, like, National doesn't set it up, so I'm gonna try to email one of the special ed teachers at my high school, and maybe they'll allow me, but they'll probably be like, oh, no, you have to go through the school, and the school will be like, hell no, because National will be like, hell no, and I'll just be fucked, you know, so, I don't know, I don't know, fuck me, I'll be fucked like these duels, I'll be fucked like these duels. Overall, I think that the Speedroid kind of Mecha Phantom Beast, it has synergy. I think it's fun, you know? I think I might stick with this for the deck, you know? Because Mecha Phantom Beast, they're shit. They're ass. Like, if you don't think that Mecha Phantom Beast are fucking trash, then yeah, they are. But the Speedroids, maybe, you know? Just, I kind of opened up shit, drew a whole bunch of Speedroids, drew 10 Twisters, couldn't do shit. You know? If I, if I would have just opened up with possibly, like, my Chasing Wings, we could have talked or something, but goddamn, I just chasing the top tier shit. <laughs> and they opened up. Decently. I can't even say that they were really good players. That's the sad thing. They didn't need to be good players. Like, this guy was like, oh, well, I don't have, I have squat. Like, yeah, right. You have top tier shit. What the fuck are you talking about? You have broken ass plays. And then fucking ABC guy, he wasn't great either. But hey, you know, when you play that really great deck and they can kind of hold your hand, you know, I tried, but I tried. So, I don't think this deck will be terrible, but I don't think it will be fantastic either. But we'll, we'll keep trying. We'll keep trying. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. So, see you tomorrow. Like I said, we changed things around. It was supposed to be, supposed to be tagging with Tremid, and then uh, Guy was supposed to be single. I switched it around, because Tremids cannot tag at all, you know? Uh, I need to have control during my turn only, and then when I switch over to my tag partner, I wouldn't have control during a duel with my field spell, changing all that, and then field spell, then change my opponent can't play any field spell, so I decided to switch out. Gaia, I can do tag, that's fine. Wow, Tremid, then be single so i'll see you guys tomorrow uh we'll do doing double daily duels once again deck profile for uh zephyrus deck profiles you get two you get two in one video so look forward to that and we'll be packing playing with our guy deck so i hope that you guys enjoyed so thanks for watching deck self support if you guys have any suggestions for this deck uh go ahead and tell me in the comment section below and uh yeah i will see you guys uh tomorrow all right